Hey there, thanks for stopping by. I'm Alicia and this is Jim Fourcore of Fourcore Heating and Air Conditioning. And this week we are talking about an HVAC industry term and that term is design conditions, Jim. So mm -hmm. I want you to tell us a little bit about, you know, what does this even mean? What is design conditions? Um, and then what is the difference from state to state? Okay, well, that's a good question, Alicia, because uh, every year I'll get calls that my furnace or my air is running too much. It's it's running all the time. It's, you know, and first of all, I'll, I'll recommend a tune up to make sure it's up to full capacity. But after that, I'll familiarize them with what is called design conditions. Because, you know, you're talking to your neighbor. Oh, mine, the neighbor will tell you his shuts off on and off every five minutes. Another one, mine runs all the time. So what is the right answer? Design conditions. In Ohio, okay, for air conditioning, when it is 90 degrees outside, your air conditioner should run almost nonstop to maintain 75 inside. So right. if you call me on a 90 degree day, I will lead you to your thermostat and I will say, what's it set at? You'll say 75. I'll ask, is it maintaining 75? Yes, it is. You do not have a problem. Your air conditioner is running properly, okay? In the winter time in Ohio, when it's two degrees outside, your furnace should run almost constantly to maintain 70 degrees inside. So if you call me and your furnace is running too much and it's zero degrees outside, I'll ask you what your thermostat's set at. You'll say 70 degrees. I'll say, is it 70? Yes, you don't have a problem. You're actually properly sized, okay? And there's a reason for that. If you want the most comfort and the most efficiency out of your equipment, we are going to size it for the design conditions here in Ohio. Now, would those conditions change in Arizona? Yes. Uh, would they change in North Carolina, Tennessee? Yes. I mean, they're more probably the, the heating temperature is higher on the design conditions. The cooling is probably higher, higher as well. So different states have different design conditions. But in Ohio, it's uh, for air conditioning, it's 75 indoor. At, at 89 or 90 outdoor and in the heating it's 70 indoor at two degree outdoor okay you know i love that you you know bring those questions on onto the, the blog like this because mm -hmm. you you are getting those questions a lot and i think it's a pretty innocent question especially with the way people are mm -hmm. um nowadays you know when you have something like that you know you, your ac won't shut off you're gonna ask mm -hmm. your friends you're gonna ask your neighbors first most of the time because you don't want to call and maybe sound sure. like you're crazy or something so you ask your friends and if they're like oh yeah mine doesn't do that well mm -hmm. their situation is a little bit different than their and than yours so sure. i think that's great that you were able to talk to us a little bit about that today and it definitely gave me some knowledge that I didn't know before which is really cool so yeah. if, if if that helped you we're really happy and we want to make sure that you know that you can explore the rest of fourcoreheating.com to learn about other topics other than just this so make sure you're doing that also give them a call if you have any questions like Jim said um, if you need any of their services they'll be able to set you up with an appointment and the team's going to be looking forward to working with you real soon so thanks for tuning in today and thank you Jim Thank you, Alicia.